we are at Cooper MMA. I'm Mark Gilston. This is my friend Chris. Uh, and today uh, I'm going to cover uh, mount, uh, dealing with a, a mount escape in an MMA kind of situation. Now, one caveat is personally, I don't really do MMA. Um, I'm more judo, BJJ with no striking, but there are techniques which, which do work and which you really sort of need to know uh, if you ever find yourself in that kind of situation. So first thing, if this is an MMA situation, he's gonna want a nice high mount. All right, that way he can strike me and it's something that I have to deal with. So I don't wanna get hit in the face, so I'm gonna protect. When I'm protecting, my hands are together, I'm gonna to come out from the center and bring his arms down. This is how I'm gonna try and stop the attack. So he's coming in. As I stop, I slide to his wrist. My foot comes into his bicep. I'm gonna straighten my foot, keeping this pull, the wrist pulled in as much as possible. That sends him way off balance. He comes over and I immediately overhook his leg and bring my leg around, getting my heel in his hip. I keep moving, rolling onto my stomach. The blade of this hand comes up right by his ankle, as high on his shin as I can get it. My hands come together. I cinch my elbow in and arch my back. So let's take a look at this, uh, this ankle lock. Um, what's going on here? Um, the heel is caught in the, back of my, in the back of my arm, behind my armpit. My wrist is up right in front of the, uh, of the shin. The other hand is holding uh, from the back. My elbow comes in and my wrist slides up and towards me. All right. So once again, that whole sequence. So protecting my face, locking the arms out to the wrists, foot comes up to the bicep, push and pull, overhook the leg. Bring it in, my foot comes around my heel goes on his hip, and I arch my back. Let's do it at speed. Okay. Okay, once again, he's punching me. And this time, while his arms are out, I'm going to buck. Uh, this usually works best when he's very, very high towards me up here. So it's hard. He's actually trying to push my arms up with his legs and compromise. This makes it very hard for me to defend. So go ahead. So in this kind of position, try and go up. Ideally, I'm going to catch him with my legs and bring him down. But maybe that's not going to happen, right? So when I come to his legs, he leans forward, right, and blocks it. Notice that I'm pushing myself forward. So now my arms are free. Grab the head, pull him all the way down. I have an overhook here. 
I'm gonna grab my arms together. Now here, I'm gonna roll him towards his head and towards my feet, right in this direction. Once I'm here, I'm not gonna go all the way to the top because I don't wanna be in his guard. You'll notice that I've trapped his leg underneath me. My bottom foot turns to keep his leg trapped. And from there, I maintain a strong side position. In MMA, I'm gonna keep this arm trapped, move this foot up, lock it. So my arms are compromised. I don't expect this to work, but I'm certainly gonna try it. But it will get him to move forward. Grab the head. Overhook the arm. Lock your hands, S lock. I'm hooking his leg here, and I'm gonna take him to those feet. Halfway, I'm sitting on his leg. Move the bottom leg out of the way. I'm hooking his leg so he can't come after me. On to the side. Keep the arm trapped. Trap that arm. And finish. If you don't like punching him, you do have that nice choke as well. Okay. He's in the medium position here. My arms are free. To the outside. I can't get my leg in, won't reach. Bring the hands down to his hips. I'm pulling them forward. He's obviously not gonna to wanna to go forward. I can take him back with the leg. Once again, I can go for an ankle lock. Can't reach. So forward, pull the arms forward. When he tries to prevent me from catching him with his foot, I'm gonna rise up on my hips and tip forward. Don't let go of the arms. You get him out, there's all sorts of things you can do from here. You'll notice that my weight is just above his knee here. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> when I turn back, it flattens his knee to the ground. Most people don't have that kind of flexibility. So once again, can't reach. Take the hands, pin them to his hips coming forward. I, can, I don't know whether we're going forward or back. I'm gonna buck him up. If I can reach with the leg, if I can't, tip. I wanna keep my weight on his leg. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Some ideas for MMA when you've been mounted. If you like the video, please click like and subscribe to our channel. Serioku Zenyo means maximum efficiency. If you click on the bell, you can get the videos as soon as they are posted. Thank you, Chris. Thank you.